Good morning, FOA squad. I'm Anthony, and welcome to our channel, Life with Anthony. I hope you guys are doing well out there. I am just getting my day started here. Uh, going to eat some breakfast first, and then I'm going to shower, run some errands for today, and I'm going to take you guys along with me during the day. All right. Now, I don't have any butter, but I will be getting some sometime during the day. But this oatmeal is sweet, sweet enough anyway. Yeah. It's plenty of sweet. <laughs> Looks like it's going to be another nice day out today. Easy and quick way of making some uh, oatmeal. I'm gonna grab some butter today and some milk today. I'm going to Walmart and I'm gonna go to Dollar Tree because let me tell you, if you have not had Dollar Tree or Dollar 25 cent tree, I should say, if you have not had their iced tea, I forgot the name of the brand of it, their front, front something. If you have not had their iced tea, from the dollar and 25 cent tree store. Uh, you're missing out. That iced tea is, ah, uh, it's so good, so good. That's some big time. Oh, you know what? Oh, where is it? I forgot. I forgot my, I forgot my blueberry, my blueberry flax granola. There we go. There we go. I just recently started eating more bacon because I am a I'm a sausage person. I prefer um, sausages over bacon. Once again, I am really enjoying the kitchen that they have here. I swear, 
Adam turned three shades darker on that cruise. It's gonna take me a couple months and we ain't even got to the summer yet. It's gonna take me to December to get my, my natural color back. <laughs> That cruise put a hurting on miss on my complexion, bro. Mm. I'm ten. I'm like three times da darker. Let me pull out. I went on that cruise. And we ain't even in summertime yet. Give me crack corn. Mm, this bacon is good. I like the thick cut bacon. Look y'all, I'm drinking water. <laughs> <laughs> I drink water y'all, for real. But I'm getting me some of that iced tea today, bro. I'm going to buy every last one of them that's in there. I hope they have some in there. I love having a refrigerator there. Oh, man, I got my water in there. It's nice and ice cold when I want to get a water. Mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm. Nothing like starting your day off with a nice breakfast. <laughs> and starting your day off with your eyes watering. <laughs> For no reason. <laughs> All right. What time is it? I think it's about, I want to say 8.30. <laughs> I need to start eating more oatmeal. Isn't oatmeal good for you? Mm -mm. I got a shower today and changed my clothes. You can get lazy on a campground, bro. Let me tell you. You get you get in that relaxed mode. Sometimes you don't feel like showering for days. <laughs> Even though the shower is just steps away. <laughs> I'm serious. Why shower every day and change clothes and then you gotta do laundry? We're moving along this, this year already. We, look, already March. One more scoop of oat and one piece of bacon left. And we are gonna be done. Bam, bam. All right. That was delicious. Mm -mm -mm. I'm not even going to lie. Because if I'm lying, and I can't, <laughs> 
Say it with me. If I'm lying, I can't. <laughs> if I'm lying, I'm flying, and I can't fly. How about I ordered four, four t-shirts from Teesprings, my own merch on January the 9th, and then I ordered two more on January, I ordered two on January the 9th, and then two more on January the 11th. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. How about I have not gotten any of them yet? None. Four t-shirts, and I have not gotten one of them yet from Teespring. <laughs> but they are supposed to be at my next campground because I changed the delivery site to my next campground, Sawmill. I'm going back to Sawmill. So my t-shirt should be waiting for me when I get to Sawmill on Sunday. If they not... I'm done with Teespring. I'm already done with them. But anyway, let's go take a shower, change clothes, brush my teeth, put my teeth in, <laughs> and we go head to Walmart and the Dollar Tree, Dollar 25 Century. All right, let's get some clothes together. Get some clothes together. See what I want to put on today, today, today. <laughs> what do I want to wear today? I act like I got a lot of clothes to choose from. <laughs> I do not. I need to organize my two clothing bags. Like, you know, t-shirts, uh, shorts, socks, underwear, because I'm all over the place. And most of the times I gotta look in both bags to get to complete. Oh my Lord, here's this shirt. I was looking for this shirt. Ah, uh, you know what, I found you. I'm gonna put you on today. Today. Now guess what, the shorts are in the other bag. No big deal, no big deal. So, uh-oh, I thought they were in the, uh-oh, come on now. Wear those, wear those black shorts. Ah, it's really time for me to throw these shorts away. I'm telling you, I can't, I can't do it. Oh my goodness, you know what? Oh good, the underwear are in this bag too. I was gonna say, I gotta go back into the other bag. What in the hoot nanny? I don't know why I just don't pick the, the, the underwear that's on top. I gotta go through, hmm, do I want green, gray, red? <laughs> just pick a pair, Anthony. <laughs> I do, I be like, <laughs> This should not be rocket science. Just pick the first. You order campground. <laughs> Why do you need to be so precise? All right. I got my bag here. This is the bag I use. Got all my uh, toothpaste and all that kind of stuff in. I don't need to shave today. I shaved yesterday. Look at this. Yes, I've been using one of the FOA tote bags. Oh, we're going to talk about these too. <laughs> and I got my towel. What I'm going to do now, right quick, is put these clothes in here. And my tote bag. And I usually just stick my towel like that. And voila. Let's go take a shower.
Alright guys, I am all dressed, got my teeth in for today, and I am heading to Walmart and the Dollar Tree. I'm gonna try to remember how to get here, get there without uh, using my GPS, because I did stay at this campground before uh, last month, and I did go to this Walmart twice during my stay here last month in January. So. I hope, I think I remember though, because it's it's pretty much a straight shot. It's only like uh, two turns and I'm about to make the first turn right here. So I think I got this. All right guys, I'm about to post up right here for about an hour, hour and a half or so and just chill and watch some YouTube videos and get some more uh, music for my videos. I uh, just wanted to show you guys this nice little area of this campground. Has a little top to it. The wind, uh, the breeze is blowing. You can see the flags blowing. So it's a real chill spot to hang out for a little bit and just relax. I'm using my um, personal hotspot. Um, the campground does have a Wi-Fi, but uh, the reception comes in better if you are like up front. So, but I want to be out here, so I'm gonna go ahead and use my own personal hotspot. I don't even use it that much, but I have been using it um, quite often uh, since I've been here at this campground, and because I didn't really want to go out and sit up front on the front porch where the office is, so I don't mind using a little bit of my hotspot. I'm just gonna check out some YouTube, see if any of my uh, subscribers, people that I'm subscribed to uh, posted a video today. Oh. Let me see what was that. Did you give anyone gifts for Christmas or is everything all over? <laughs> She's cooking at a different angle now.
Oh, did I tell you guys that? Did I tell you guys that I lost my eyeglasses on Sunday when I got here and all the chaos of setting up my um, site? Um, I misplaced my eyeglasses and I'm telling you the rest of Sunday, all Monday, I found them on Tuesday, uh, yesterday. No, I found them. Yeah, I found them on Tuesday and I cleaned my van out completely. I mean, I reorganized it, cleaned it out, and thought maybe the glasses were in there somewhere because the last time I misplaced my glasses, they fell in between the uh, seats. And then, so I thought that's probably where they could have been again, but they were not there. Then I put the tent up and I looked inside the tent. There was no glasses there. And so then the next day, I looked all on the ground, everywhere, and I just could not find these eyeglasses. And then I went somewhere. Where did I go? I moved the, um, oh, I went to the uh, trash compactor at the beginning of the camp when you first enter because I wanted to take some trash and stuff out. And when I backed up and parked and got out of the van, I just happened to look down and the eyeglasses were smashed into the ground. And luckily for me, they they did not break. They were like this into the ground. And luckily for me, they were all dirty and stuff. No wonder I couldn't see them when I was looking around the, the ground because they they had mud all over the, the uh, lens and everything. And so <laughs> I picked them up and this handle right here was kind of out of shape and I tried my best to put it back in shape without breaking it because you know how sometimes you, you do this and it will break off. Well, it's still not the best, but this one right here, I straighten it out. I still have some more room to uh, straighten it up a little bit more so that it can fit. When I first cleaned them off and put them on, they wouldn't stay on because this one was too far out. So now they're a little better. I'm getting some new uh, eyeglasses when I get back to PA because I have a scratch mark right here and I feel like I'm looking at a, a little spot of dirt all the time and I go to clean it and then I remember to myself, oh, that's a scratch. It's not dirt, Anthony. It's a scratch. But yeah, I was so happy I found these eyeglasses. I do have the, um, the, like, the prescription sunglasses ones that I would have, you know, had to just wear them until I got back to PA and go to um, America's Best Eyeglass Place. But I'm so happy I found these eyeglasses, you know. And I told myself after the first day I couldn't find them to just leave it alone, don't worry about it, and hopefully I will come across them. And I most certainly did came across them, so I was so happy. I'm checking out... Uh, Nomadic Introvert latest video. See? I ended up going just to um, Dollar Tree instead of Walmart because when I went to make my list of what I thought I wanted to get from Walmart, I actually could have gotten all those things from the dollar and 25 cent tree store. So I went there and they did have everything that um, I was going to go to Walmart and get. So that saved me a little trip, a little extra uh ways that I didn't have to go to get to the Walmart. But yeah, got some things from Dollar Tree. I think the best thing about Dollar Tree is um, that tea. That iced tea that they have there, that sweet tea. Oh, I think it's called, the brand is Front, Front Door or something like that. I can't remember. But man, oh man, is it, it's so, it's so good. It's so, so good. You know what? I'm going to go and get one and show you guys what it is. 
Let me put her. Let me put her on pause. All right, I didn't bring it out here, but it's called um, Front Porch. That's the name of the brand, Front Porch. And I'm telling you, that ice, that sweet tea is so good, so good. But anyway, guys, I think I'm gonna wrap this video up here because I'm not gonna do too much uh, more at the moment. Uh, I'm thinking about going to the pool and because I have not been taking advantage of the swimming pools at these campgrounds, uh, mainly because some of the campgrounds, the swimming pools be too crowded for me and I, I don't wanna be in a crowded pool, crowded pool. But this pool here um, is either very few people in it or any no one in it at all. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish watching a Nomadics video and check out some other videos for a little bit. And then uh, I'm just gonna relax because right now it's probably about quarter after 12, uh, so a little bit afternoon. So I still have most of my day ahead of me and I'm just gonna chill, enjoy the nice weather that we're having here at this campground. And that's gonna do it. So guys, as always, thank you guys for uh, taking a few minutes out of your day to watch my videos. I appreciate you guys, you know that. And I'll see you guys the next time.